one of the things that I, I really like to work with, with, you know, with the behaviors and the, the understanding of these triggers and how things actually, you know, appear in your body. But the first, the first step is to, to acknowledge that something is going on. And this is difficult to do. Um, I mean, I would say even, even for me, not like I'm a, I'm a guru or a master at this at all, but for everybody to not just move to the next thing and try to get out of a situation. It's, it's a very, very hard thing to do. And if you can use breathing to stay in that, I think it's a very good idea. So the example would be if you're in the breathing class and of course, something is, it's, you experience something that might be challenging. Um, there's a multiple ways that you may want to use to get out of that. It could be, you know, you stop breathing that you want to get out of it 